A young boy travels to an enchanted land in search of his real parents. Timothy Bottoms, Christopher Lee, and Susanna York star in The Land of Far Away, next on HBO. The following movie is rated PG. Teen astronauts save the day when a malfunction causes a shuttle to blast off into orbit. Kate Capshaw and Tom Skerritt co-star in Space Camp, next on HBO. The following movie is rated PG. Next, an animated adventure featuring everyone's favorite elephant, that most popular of pachyderms from the beloved children's series, Babar, next on HBO. The brightest stars, the biggest hits. HBO, the best movies. You looking for a police drama with tough cops, gorgeous dames, and international intrigue with a hero. Lieutenant Revan, police squad. Who's tough yet suave? Can I interest you in my cap? No, thank you. I don't wear them. You want a movie starring Leslie Nielsen? Yeah! With an all-star cast? You bet you do. Why? It's a riotous roller coaster of a screwball comedy. The Naked Gun from the Files of Police Squad. Thursday on HBO. This week, HBO is simply the best. Every Monday at 7.30, it's an all-new episode of Babar. Then at 8, the premiere of Dream a Little Dream. Tuesday at 8, if you missed its premiere, Morgan Freeman stars in Lean on Me. At 10, the premiere of an all-new, not necessarily the news. Wednesday at 10, if you missed its premiere, One Night Stand, Charles Fleischer. I'm Mina Griscom for HBO Entertainment News. In Manhattan's Artie Soho District, celebrities and socialites browsed through art displays donated for the cause of pro-choice. Celebrities were quick to point out, however, that pro-choice does not necessarily mean pro-abortion. Although I am a Catholic and I was brought up in a convent, and I have a lot of, uh, a lot of doubts about whether I feel abortion is the right answer for anyone, I still feel that women should be given the right to decide for themselves. Billed as the nation's largest pro-choice fundraiser to date, the event featured works from 55 of the country's leading artists. I don't know how long it takes to do one of these things, but I know how long it takes me to work on something, and it's a lot of work. The entertainment for the evening was also donated, including the talents of comedic performer Reno. I happen to be, of course, pro-choice, and in fact, we're kind of surprised that it's coming up again, aren't we? I mean, we thought we wrote the Constitution 200 years ago. Next thing you know, it's gone. It, where is it? We don't know. The Bill of Rights, where the hell are they? They're at the Xerox shop, getting reduced. The evening raised over $800,000 for the cause. Singer-songwriter Carly Simon has a new album in record stores this week. My Romance celebrates Carly's own romance with classic songs and the show tune she fell in love with as a child. My family was very much involved in the world of the musicals, and they took us as soon as we were old enough to go to Oklahoma and Carousel and South Pacific, Kiss Me Kate. So I've been a lover of these songs for a long, long time. Simon will perform selections from her new album in an HBO special debuting April 15th. Carly in concert, My Romance, will be the Grammy winner's second concert for HBO. The reason that I'm with HBO is a mutual admiration. We worked well together on the first HBO special that I did for Martha's Vineyard, and it didn't occur to me to go, I don't, I don't know any other channels. 
Jamie Lee Curtis channels her energy onto the big screen this week as a lady cop who may be flirting with a killer in blue steel. Curtis feels the film may shatter a few images in Hollywood. I don't look at that there's just this big wall around Hollywood that says no women's cop pictures. Um, certainly, if someone who didn't think that this was possible will see this and after seeing it go, oh, wow, women can do this. Blue Steel shoots its way into theaters this week. I'm Nina Griscom. Next, an animated adventure featuring everyone's favorite elephants, that most popular pachyderms from the beloved children's series, Babar, next on HBO. All right, mystery fans, get ready for an all-new series starring the world's greatest kid super sleuth, Encyclopedia Brown. That's right, he's back with his partner, Sally, and all your favorite characters, like Chief Brown. Would you believe he's the chief of police? Mrs. Brown, would you believe she married Mr. Brown? And that fiendish town bully, Bugs Meany, and his favorite punching bag, Zool. Six brand new episodes full of thrills and daring deeds. We're being invaded! Six stories of intrigue and suspense. I've got clues, I've got suspects, and I've got moments. Six adventures about catching no good slime slinging bad guys everywhere. You slime. So run, don't walk for Encyclopedia Brown Boy Detective. Right here on HBO. Is that a far out concept or what? <laughs> Nick was used to taking care of himself. Dad? Come on! Let's go! Come on, you chicken! Until a sudden illness forced him into the care of others. I need you to stay in the hospital for a little bit longer. No, 